Hello guys, Hyunwoo here. Kyungwa here. And you're watching Talk, Talk to, to Me, me in Korean. Korean. Welcome to another video lesson. And in this video, we're going to cover some Korean phrases that you can use in a Korean restaurant as a waiter or a waitress. waitress. <laughs> Have you worked as a waitress before? No, I haven't. Me neither. <laughs> but we do know the phrases because we've been going to Korean restaurants all our lives. Yeah, every day. Yeah, maybe not as a baby or a child, <laughs> but yeah, quite often. So if you get to work in a Korean restaurant, these are the phrases that you can use. And also, if you learn from this video, you will know what kind of phrases that you can hear from Korean waiters or waitresses. That's right. Okay, so let's say you are a waitress and see some people coming in through the mm. door. Uh -huh. What is the first question you have to ask them? 몇 분이세요? 몇 분이세요? 몇 분이세요? Yes, 몇 분이세요 means How many are you? Yes, how many are you? How many chairs do you need? How many tables do you need? So, let's say I have just one more friend with me. I say 두 명이요. 네, 두 두 명이요. 두 명이요. I say 명, but you have to say 분. Yeah, 명 and 분 are both counters for people. Mm -hmm. So I can say 명 because I'm talking about myself. But you want to be honorific because you are a service person. So you say 분. 분. 몇 분이세요? And I say 두 명이요. 아. Let's say there are 10 people in my group and I say 열 명이요. And you confirm with me by saying 아, 열 분이세요? Okay, so that is 분 and 명. 몇 분이세요? Mm -hmm. That is the first question you can ask. And if you're working in a restaurant that takes reservations, usually you can ask the customer. 예약하셨어요? 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 What is the word for reservation? 예약. 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 And a polite way of saying, did you do it? Is 하셨어요? 하셨어요? Did you do your reservation? 예약하셨어요? 예약하셨어요? Okay, so those are two phrases that you can say. Mm -hmm. And after you ask them how many there are in their group or whether they have made a reservation or not, you can say, 네, 들어오세요. 네, 들어오세요. 네, 들어오세요. 네, 들어오세요. 네, 들어오세요. And it means, please come in. Or you can also tell them to follow you by saying, 이쪽으로 오세요. 이쪽으로 오세요. 이쪽으로 오세요. 이쪽 means here, this side, this way. So 이쪽으로 오세요 means come in, come here, this way. Yeah, come this way. Mm -hmm. And let's suppose you're working in a very popular restaurant and you don't have any seats available for the customer. Mm -hmm. You have to tell them the bad news. So in that case, you might be able to say 죄송합니다, 지금 자리가 없네요. 죄송합니다, 지금 자리가 없네요. So how do you say I'm sorry first? 죄송합니다. There's no seats available now for you. 지금 자리가 없네요. Now is 지금 and 자리 is seat. So 지금 자리가 없네요. There are no seats for you. 지금 자리가 없네요. Or what if it looks like a table will be clear in about 10 minutes. Mm. What do you tell the customer? 10분 정도 기다리셔야 될것 같습니다. 10분 정도 기다리셔야 될것 같습니다. 10분 정도 기다리셔야 될것 같습니다. 10분 is 10 minutes. 10분 정도 is approximately 10 minutes. And 기다리다 is to wait. 기다리셔야 될것 같습니다. It means I think you will have to wait. 10분 정도 기다리셔야 될것 같습니다. 10분 정도 기다리셔야 될것 같습니다. All right. Let's say the welcoming part is done and there are seats available for the customer. You just want to guide them first. Mm -hmm. So please sit here is 이쪽에 앉으세요. 이쪽에 앉으세요. 이쪽에 앉으세요. Or 이쪽으로 앉으세요 is fine too. Mm -hmm. 이쪽으로 앉으세요. And if your restaurant happens to be pretty big, you mm -hmm. might also say 안쪽으로 앉으세요. 안쪽으로 앉으세요. 안쪽으로 앉으세요. It means you will find some seats available inside. Yes. 안쪽으로 앉으세요. 안쪽으로 앉으세요. Okay, and if you want to let the customer choose wherever they want to sit, mm -hmm. you can say 편하신데 앉으세요. 편하신데 앉으세요. 편하신데 앉으세요. 편하다 is to be comfortable or to be convenient, and 대 is a spot. So 편하신데 means a convenient spot for you or a comfortable place for you, and 앉으세요 means please sit. So, 편하신데 앉으세요. 편하신데 앉으세요. After the customer sit down, what do you have to do? You have to take orders, I guess. Yeah, so you can say, 주문 도와드릴까요? 주문 도와드릴까요? 주문 도와드릴까요? 주문 is order. 도와드릴까요 means, shall I help you? Should I help you? 음. 주문 도와드릴까요? Can I help you with your order? Or you can also say, 주문하시겠어요? 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 하시겠어요 is a very polite way to say, would you like to do it? 주문하시겠어요? 주문하시겠어요? Would you like to order is, 주문하시겠어요? And would you like me to help you with your order is, 주문 도와드릴까요? 주문 도와드릴까요? Now, the customers have decided what to eat and they have ordered. Mm -hmm. And you say, 네. 
잠시만요. 네, 잠시만요. 네, 잠시만요. 네, 잠시만요. 잠시만요 means just a little while or just a sec or wait for a second or even I'll be back. So if there's something that you don't know really well, if you're not sure about something, you can just talk with the other staff and come back. And before you do that, you can say 네, 잠시만요. And in situations where everything's fine, mm -hmm. you just took the order mm -hmm. and you just have to bring them the food. Mm -hmm. In that case, you can say 곧 갖다 드리겠습니다. 곧 갖다 드리겠습니다. 갖다 드리다 is a polite way of saying 갖다 주다. And 갖다 주다 means to bring something to someone. All right, so now meal is over. Yeah, the meal is over. The mm -hmm. customer is happy and they're about to leave. And they might not be so sure where to pay if the mm -hmm. restaurant is big or complicated and you might want to guide them by saying 네, 이쪽에서 계산 도와드리겠습니다 and you know show them the way to the counter mm -hmm, yes 이쪽에서, 이쪽에서 이쪽에서 means here over here or this way and 계산 is again calculation or paying 도와드리겠습니다 means I will help you with that 이쪽에서 계산 도와드리겠습니다 이쪽에서 계산 도와드리겠습니다. 이쪽에서 계산 도와드리겠습니다. It basically means pay here. <웃음> 이쪽에서 이쪽에서 계산 도와드리겠습니다. 이쪽에서 계산 도와드리겠습니다. All right, and after that, if the customer wants a receipt, receipt is 영수증. 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 Even if the customer forgets to mention that, it might be a good idea to ask them by saying 영수증 필요하세요? 영수증 필요하세요? 영수증 필요하세요? 영수증 필요하세요? Alright, so that's it. The customer is leaving and mm -hmm. you want to say goodbye to them by saying 감사합니다. 또 오세요. 감사합니다. 또 오세요. 감사합니다. 또 오세요. 또 오세요. 또 means again. 오세요 means please come. Yeah, so 또 오세요 means please come back. See you next time and hope to serve you again. 또 오세요. Okay, so we've covered some phrases that you can use in a Korean restaurant as a waiter or a waitress. If there are some phrases that you would still like to know, please let us know by leaving us comments and in the next video, we will cover some really interesting phrases as well. So please be subscribed to see our latest videos. And we'll see you at talktomeinkorean.com and harukorean.com. 안녕히 계세요. Bye.